So, two weeks tonight until the opening ceremony. Many of our athletes are warming up at the London leg of the Athletics Grand Prix. The event's being held in Crystal Palace this weekend and will feature some of the world's best competitors for the final race ahead of the Games. Our sports reporter, Sally Williams, is there for us tonight. Sally. Well, for the crowds, this is a real pleaser. For the athletes, time has never ticked more poignantly and one of the men who's kept rather a low profile recently but is back in the spotlight is the Hackney-born triple jumper, Philips Idowu. Now he won a silver medal in Beijing and some are hoping he might just pull out a gold in London. But there have been a few questions over whether he's injured. He didn't go to the Olympic trials and the head coach recently said he couldn't divulge any information because of medical confidentiality. But when we met up with Phillips this week on the Thames, he said there were no such problems at all. Six foot six with a range of piercings, he's hard to miss. And yet, we've hardly seen him lately. But that's just how Phillips Adowu likes it. When he did speak to us, it was a chance to put an end to speculation he's hurt his foot. There's been a lot of talk about injuries, but none of it's actually come from me. So um, it's all speculation. I'm just preparing for the games. Um, I'm getting myself in the best possible shape that I can. And I feel that I'm getting there. I've got less than 30 days till I compete in a final and I'm positive about my chances. Do you feel in good enough shape? I, I feel in really good shape. Um, I had a really good, great start to the season, um, put in some great performances in some atrocious conditions. And I'm confident, I have to be confident. It's, um, this is gonna be the biggest competition of my life. And your foot, how is that doing? Um, you want to see me moonwalk? I'm, it's, it's pretty good. <laughs> Not wanting to be responsible for any future injury, we didn't make him. After all, Phillips is gunning for a gold medal after winning silver at the last Olympics and the World Championships. Are you nervous? I mean, how do you handle the pressure? I know you don't. You've kept quite low profile media-wise. Mm. No nerves. Nerves are not an issue right now. I think I've been I've been in this sport for coming on 12 years now, so I feel that. I've got enough experience to deal with the nerves and the anticipation and stuff. What's the excitement like in your East London household with your little babies? Oh my goodness, it's crazy. Um, and especially with all the Olympic school projects that are going, <laughs> going on. My daughter came home and she brought home an Olympic talks that she's made. So it is massively <laughs> exciting. Um, but I, I, you know, I can't put it into words. Final question, weather. If it rains torrentially, how much is it going to ruin your sport on the day if it rains terribly it may be a massive advantage for me to be honest because i live in the uk and i'm used to it <laughs> great another of our athletes keen on the uh...